After recently marking one year since the death of Benny Napoleon, the Wayne County Sheriff's Department is mourning the loss of another one of their own to COVID. Corporal Ernest Robinson died yesterday at the age of 50. Our Megan Woods has a look at who he was and why he'll be so badly missed. The data shows for the second straight year, COVID is the leading cause of death in U.S. law enforcement. And unfortunately, Wayne County Sheriff's Office is no exception. Oh, say can you see? That's the voice of Corporal Ernest Robinson. It's going to truly be missed. What so proudly we hailed. Corporal Robinson had 26 years with the Wayne County Sheriff's Office before he died of COVID at the age of 50. One of our, our, our bright uh, stars in the Sheriff's Office. And is now one of five at the Sheriff's Office who's died from COVID since March 2020. Uh, we lost uh, three in um, 2020, including our former sheriff. Uh, we had a commander and then a corporal all in 2020. Then in 2021, the end of 2021, we lost an officer uh, that worked in our secondary roles to COVID. According to the National Law Enforcement Memorial and Museum, last year, 458 law enforcement officers died in the line of duty. About 300 of those deaths were caused by COVID. This pandemic has definitely put a hole in law enforcement, uh, along with those that are retiring. Wednesday, the Sheriff's Department announced they're recruiting to fill 100 positions in 2022. You can come in as 18, 19 year old and even older, uh, making about $41,000 as a flat rate uh, a year. Those 100 open positions vary from working in the jail to narcotics, road patrol. There are a lot of different opportunities. You just have to be 18 and older to apply. I'm Megan Woods, Local 4. Megan, we appreciate it, and we'll have a link to an application as well as a closer look at that law enforcement study on clickondetroit.com.